All right, well, the Houston Food Bank is joining forces with the incredible San Jose Clinic for an important cause, all to help those in need. To explain what is going on, I'm honored to have Danielle Sanders with the Health Partnerships Manager for the Houston Food Bank right over here, and Kimberlyn Clarkson. She's Chief Advancement Officer for San Jose Clinic. Ladies, thank you so much for being here. Thank I appreciate you for it. having us. So what is going on? I mean, the San Jose Clinic is incredible. Houston Food Bank, we love you. We're partners with you. So what is going on with this? So the San Jose Clinic for over 100 years has supported patients that are uninsured and in many cases underserved, um, just improve their health outcomes. Mm -hmm. And we know that nutrition is a critical component of improving health outcomes. And so we're so uh, honored and blessed to be partnered with the Houston Food Bank in this endeavor to ensure that our patients get access to quality foods and nutritious items so that they can improve themselves. That's wonderful because the nutrition on the inside is just as important as everything else that helps the body heal too, as That's well. Right. We have been partners with the Houston Food Bank for quite some time. We we're actually volunteering just a couple of weeks ago. What does it mean for the Houston Food Bank to join San Jose Clinic? Yeah, absolutely. The Houston Food Bank, as many people know, distributes food to the community, to, to neighbors in need. But what people don't actually know is that we run a lot of programming. And so one program that we do run is the FoodRx program. And we partner with health clinics like San Jose Clinic to deliver a food prescription, making sure, like Kimberlyn said, that food is nutritious and that we can help patients and neighbors um, reduce those financial trade-offs facing food insecurity and really focus on improving their health outcomes. I'm glad you mentioned about financial trade-off because I always hear that people have to decide between their medication or food and you Absolutely. should never have to be put in that position. Absolutely. So when they come to the clinic, do they go through the process of examinations, but then what do they get from the Houston Food Bank while they're there? Sure. So our goal is to be a health care home for patients who otherwise would not have access to health care. Like you mentioned, a lot of our patients are choosing between housing and and food and all of those things and so health care you know kind of goes down the ladder uh, priorities for them and so when they're coming they're getting access to primary and specialty care if they're diabetic they're able to you know um, access that care and then they're able to learn about how nutrition and exercise and all of that will help improve it's not just you know pharmaceutical intervention but how your whole you know kind of holistic uh, outlook on health and impacts and again the partnership with Houston Food Bank helps solidify that for us now to continue this partnership though people need to donate to the Houston Food Bank as well, correct? Or um, just to make sure that you have all of this nutritional um, information and, and food that people will need. So what can we do to help you guys to help San Jose Clinic? Yeah, so actually donating to San Jose Clinic, I think, is something uh, mm -hmm. that Kimberlyn can speak to. But aside from just donating food and donating um, finances, um, another way that people can get involved is by volunteering with the Houston Food Bank. We love our volunteers, and we couldn't be able to serve um, the way that we do without that. Wonderful. Well, I want to thank both of you for being here. We are going to have another component to get more information from both of these extraordinary women on um, our website, CW39.com. We've got another interview we're doing with you on our digital platform, and then you can find all the information from San Jose Clinic as well as the Houston Food Bank on CW39.com. Thank you so much for being thank here. You. And thank, thank you. Thank you for both of you and all that you do to help this community. It's thank really you. needed. Thank you. All right, over to you.